So guys, I love that story of Jeremiah because we're never too young to be used by God. And that's a really cool thing for all of us to learn and to know that it doesn't matter how young we are or how old we are, God wants to use us. And Jeremiah says to God, God, I I can't be used by you because I'm too young. And God goes, don't worry, Jeremiah, I'll be with you. And that's something that I think we can all learn. And we can trust God that, you know what, even though we're young, he still can speak to us and he can speak through us and he can use us in our families, with our friends, in our communities, in our neighborhood. You know what? God wants to use us and uh, we can pray and we can ask God to, uh, to speak through us. So maybe this week, it's something that we can all try and do. We can ask God to speak through us to be able to help our mums and dads and our families and maybe our friends. And if you're back at school, maybe your teachers or your friends in your bubble at school. You know what? These things are limitless for God. And he's awesome and wants to use us and speak to us and uh, speak through us. So we need to be able to tell our friends and our family about what Jesus has done for us, what he's doing for us and how awesome God is. So let us trust God like Jeremiah did and let him be able to use us no matter how young we are. Our memory verse today uh, is one of my favourite verses. Like I said, it's from Jeremiah 29 verse 11. And maybe your mums and dads might know this verse. And the version I know in the NIV says, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you. And that's amazing. God gave Jeremiah those words that God knows the plans that he has for him, but also the plans he has for us. And his plans are good. His plans are there not to harm us, to give us a hope and a future, to keep us safe and to love us no matter what. And that's something that's a promise that we can live by in our lives. Guys, it's been so awesome being able to have Salt Cellar with you this morning. I trust you're all keeping well. If you've got any prayer requests, any memory verse stuff, any jokes, anything that you want to send me. If you've had some creative ideas at home of drawing, colouring in, building things, please let me know. It'll be awesome to see what you guys are getting up to. I miss you loads and I look forward to when we can get together soon. God bless you guys and we'll see you next week. Goodbye.